All right, guys, Good Boy 32 here. Check it out. So I'm sitting in my home office. And then behind me is a little organizational thing that I've made for storing ammo, optics, scopes, and things like that. And uh, in this closet, I've got a hanger rod going across here. It's kind of cool because I can hang my clothes up or whatever. It's my own personal little space. Okay, let's get to it. The purpose of this video is to help promote a small business called Redneck Rifle Hangers. Uh, there's going to be a link down below and a discount code for 10% off. KB32 is your discount code and RedneckRifleHangers.com is the website. Well, what is a Redneck Rifle Hanger? Well, I got a call from Chad and he was like, you know what? Uh, I was sitting around one day trying to figure out something cool that I could do and I could sell and manufacture at my own. He, ha he actually has a patent on this thing. And, I, you know, kudos to him. He's a veteran as well, which is one of the reasons why we always help promote small businesses, American-made, and veteran. So anyway, I, I talked to him, and I said, send me a couple of them, because I'd really like to see, see how they work. But I also want to demonstrate to people how they work as well. So, the Redneck Rifle Hanger. Here's a closet. And in this closet, right here, there are three AR-15s stacked up in here. Now, are they... Are they stored and locked up? No, but I'll tell you what, uh, this is a great option if you have a closet that you want to just keep an AR sitting up in. Look at this. You'd never be able to know, but check this out. Wham. Look at this thing. There's one sitting right there. Move that over. There's another one sitting right here. And right behind that, there's another one. There's three ARs. Now, what is the rifle hanger? What exactly does it look like? Well, let's show you. I think this is pretty ingenious. But look at that. It's a, looks like a quarter inch aluminum that has just been bent to support one on the front of the mag well and two on the buffer. Now, surrounding, let me go ahead and just set this over here. Matter of fact, uh, where the hell am I going to do with you? Let's put you down here. So, what does this thing have? Piece of wire, look at it just like that. There's pieces of rubber around this area and this area. These are the contact points. This sits on the front of your mag well, and this is on the back of the buffer tube. These things, this is absolutely, in my mind, uh, a brilliant, brilliant. But uh, to set it in place, all you do is, well, yeah, just like this. And there you are. And it's hanging just like that and we can hang it up boom you can hide it in your closet just like that here's another one right here boom just like that out in the way and hidden out of sight out of mind so anyway when i saw this thing this is one of those deals where yeah i am impressed i do like it and it sells itself. Uh, retail on it is $27 and change. Uh, also, if you order two of them, you get free shipping. But again, you got the discount code of KB32. 10% off. Oh, yeah. But that's pretty cool. And it protects your firearm while it's in there. Boom. You get a whole bunch of those, man. You can stack probably 15, 20 ARs in here, cover it up, and no one will ever know it's there. All right, guys, that's it. Redneck Rifle Hangers, just a short video, kind of helping out small businesses. We've got a couple more that we're getting ready to do. Uh, we've got some steel targets. I've got this thing called the Black Rack, which is absolutely neat. It's gonna go in my vehicle. And then we also have the really cool stuff by uh, Gray, somebody, guns, something, not sure, but we're gonna be doing a lot of stuff this week. It's Good Boy 32. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Subscribe if you haven't already done so. Always end them like this. Sport red, white, and blue. God bless America. God bless his men, women in uniform, 24-7 for our freedom, because freedom's not free. That's cool as it gets. What a smart character to come up with something like that. And I know what you're saying. I wish I could have done that. Let's help this guy be successful. Here we go. 132. I am out of here. Y'all be good.